Welcome to Denver, Colorado, where the defending champs are catching fire at the right time, winning four straight, nine of ten, with ten games left, starting tonight against the Phoenix Suns. Extra pass by Booker to the corner, and the three goes for Beal. You look at them, you'd feel like they'd be better, but they shoot a high percentage. Uh, Phoenix fifth in the NBA when they do do it. And then there's Denver. Just, I said they don't shoot a lot. <laughs> they're doing it. Uh, Beal playing in his 14th consecutive game, and he's got back-to-back -back triples for the Suns here in the first two minutes. You can see he's got uh, tape on finger, two fingers on his uh, right hand as Jokic gets inside and scores. He's missed just three games this season. Nice move by Booker along the baseline, and it's 8-5 Suns. They won here in Denver in overtime without Booker. That's one of two losses that Denver has suffered since the All-Star break. The other was on that crazy Kyrie Irving running left-handed hook in Dallas a few weeks back. Well, nice pass there. Booker with the slam. Three-point lead for Phoenix. Shot clock down to four. Allen doing a good job fronting Jokic. So pull, pull. Pulls the trigger and hits his second three. These players have just gotten all gotten better, even since last year when they were champions. Durant drills the three. And Kevin Durant with his first field goal and five early points for him. Booker's three is good. And Phoenix with four three-pointers here in the first five minutes. Durant falls down and Gordon gets his second slam of the game. Good ball movement by... Denver, but the Suns reacting to every pass. Porter eventually, though, just too good with the shot and too tall, able to rise up over the smaller defender. Long three, Porter, and it. Michael Porter Jr. from deep. This play-in tournament, it's just going to be some of the best players we've seen in the NBA in a long time, and there's Booker knocking one down again. Picture these, look, Denver's not going to be in the play -in, so forget that. But this could be a first-round matchup. <laughs> this guy, that's 3-3. Three, three. Booker with eight points. Good ball movement, Phoenix Beal lets it fly, and it's good for his third three of the opening quarter. He's got taping it up his, I think, middle finger and, and index finger, and he's, he's shooting great. Colin Gillespie, excellent three-point shooter, doesn't get a ton of minutes. Booker with the defender on his hip, he's so good at that. And case in point right there with Peyton Watson, a really good defender, riding his hip. Watson blocked by Durant from behind. Tracked down by Christian Brown. Shot clock down to three. Durant drives and scores. Just muscling his way past the defender. Here's Straw, the rookie from Gonzaga. And he gets the push shot to go. Late first round pick. Last summer, Durant off balance, gets the bounce. And Durant started to get it going now. Durant driving on Watson, who's got two fouls. Great recovery, Watson got the block. And Christian Brown out of there with it. That guy right there, Christian Brown. He's in that bench unit. Beal on the attack. He wondered, too, about the uh, foot situation for Gordon, if he can play his normal minutes as another Gordon, Eric Gordon, hits the three. Michael Malone calls another timeout. That is seven threes for the Suns, whereas Phoenix, you got Bradley Beal. They're fighting for their lives. And so he, he has to play through it. Denver has the luxury of saying, look, we're going to be one, two, or three. And so they can be cautious about his quarter. Nice move to the basket. They are the defending champs. They know that they're going to need Jamal Murray and, and Aaron Gordon, and, who, and, and their best players, to get them there. And it's not the time. Here's Aaron Gordon back on the court. Porter with a little airspace, a long two, and what a bounce from all it looked like that had no chance of going in. Beal on the drive. Good look. Here's Allen on the spot up. And Grayson Allen drilling his second three-pointer. No look to Caldwell Pope. Nice pocket feed to the dunker, Aaron Gordon. 11 assists for Denver. Bull Bull left wide open, and he is a very good three-point shooter. Michael Malone again shaking his head, but doesn't want to call a fourth timeout. Gordon underneath. Jokic with the assist. Count the basket. And one. Three-point opportunity for Aaron Gordon. Caldwell Pope with four to shoot. Jokic spinning. Shovels it to Gillespie. And drills a three. What a nifty pass by Jokic. His seventh assist. Leans in there again. Takes the shot. Whatever's necessary. It's just whatever angle. 8 nothing Denver runs. He finds a way either with the pass or the shot. Ball hits the two. Ball, ball. Off the bench in seven minutes has eight points. This is what happens. Jokic back in the game. He sat out. They gave up eight points. Now they're back in it. Approaching two minutes remaining in the first half. Durant creating some space and hitting the short baseline jumper. What a pass by Jokic. Met by Durant. That's his fourth block as he swats it away from Porter. I mean, he does so much on offense. And that's a great contest. That's 
Michael Porter Jr. just having a tremendous season. Uh, Durant working on the smaller Gillespie, turns around, cans it. 14 points now for Durant. Reggie Jackson, no points in the first half, and now on the scoreboard in the starting lineup for the injured Jamal Murray tonight. Jackson in year 13 out of Boston College. Pull-up jumper goes for Kevin Durant. A game-high 16. A turnover by Durant. Two on one, the lob to Gordon from Caldwell Pope. Phoenix knows what's at stake. I mean, you heard Brad Beal say, we got 10 games left, they all matter. Eubanks with the slam, great pass by Durant that time. And a Denver foul. Durant downhill gets the lefty reverse. And Phoenix with a 10 point lead. Pull up three, Durant got it. Kevin Durant with 21 points, eight of 12 from the floor. Well, Jokic took over late in the first half to get Denver in the game, and he looked to do it here. He gets that little runner. That's just his seventh shot attempt, an eight point. Jokic had it poked away, regathers, and scores. Jokic in double figures now with 10. The average Gordon's been getting something going in transition the last few possessions. Another block for Durant, his fifth. Jokic. Here he is shooting a three, and hit it again. Jokic with his first three. Jokic being defended by Eubanks, spins on him. They don't blow the whistle, and Jokic gets the basket, and he's fouled. A chance at a three-point play. Durant trying to get by Porter, does a nice job contesting, but Durant just too good. Better offense beats decent defense, 23 for KD. Transition three opportunity, Booker, good. More of that, right? More of that for Phoenix. Durant on the turnaround, up to 25 points. Jackson from Jokic, another assist. And again, Jokic buying a little time in the backcourt, so the uh, clock wouldn't start, so they get a two-for-one. Jackson does his part, hits the three. And a four-second difference in the game in shot clocks now. Young down the middle of the lane with the layup. Frank Vogel, we asked him before the game, fourth quarter. He said, it's a lot about executing. And, and, and I think that's it. I think he put his finger on it. But again, they've got this lead now. Let's see if they can hold it. They give up a three there to Gordon. That's the first triple tonight for Aaron Gordon. Shot clock at two. Here's Gordon sensing it. Left-handed runner banks home. Maybe it's Phoenix's night. Well, those type of shots go in, you make you make yourself believe it will be. Jokic now with 18 points, nine assists, seven rebounds. Jokic back on the floor for the last three minutes here. Gordon, baseline, strong move, couldn't get a great tip by Watson. It's 89-81, O'Neal for three, and he drills it. That's the 14-3 for Phoenix tonight. The starters are back out there, and Allen cans a three. But Grayson Allen with his third three-pointer. Jokic missed that, offensive rebound, Watson in the putback. Three from Durant, good! And Kevin Durant with 28 points on 15 shots. Uh, and you wonder, can they can they be consistent? And that, that's the question. Okay. Can they do this each game? And as you mentioned earlier, I mean, what if you have Dallas, Phoenix, Golden State, and the Lakers in the play? -in? Any of those teams, as Durant now has 30 points, you can see not only winning the play in, but then winning a more than one series. Yeah, that's you know, and, and I think that's a testament to. The depth of each conference, really. Allen, oh, tough shot. He knew the shot clock was winding down, got caught in the air, didn't have a passing lane, so he just put it up and made it. Been that kind of a night. Jackson banks it in. Here comes Jokic, trying to get it to single digits. Porter attacking and flushing. 102-93. As Jackson doesn't want the two, look like he's playing defense, but he was actually an offense there, lays it in. How challenging is it once you've won that first championship to manage the regular season knowing what is necessary in the postseason, especially at this stage when the light is, is at the end of the tunnel, the postseason is right around the corner. I mean, look, it's 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 about health. It's about hunger. It's one of the best wins of the season for the Phoenix Suns, given the context of what is right now and what lies ahead the final nine games of the regular season. So for now, Phoenix moves a half game up on Sacramento and Denver, Minnesota, Oklahoma City. If you look at the loss column, all tied atop the Western Conference standings.